when they cross the line of control the boy on the duty there told this company commander he called me up directly and the chirpiness the josh in his voice sir chale gaye yeah. but that is what balakot did to the morale of every indian what happened at balakot uh, you know there are so many versions that one has heard you've heard politicians talk about it there's media reporting and there was a lot of controversy also ki mara ki nahi mara kya mara kuch nahi pata so you know the pakistan got the narrative lead uh, on that and they managed to manipulate uh, international opinion and to some extent even indian opinion in the media in certain sections of the media so while there was an operations part of it there was also the ground situation in india and then there was a media element to it you saw all that happening so could you give us shed some light on what happened then Ma'am, I'll uh, put it little differently. G. Point is, we did it. We hit back after Pulwama. We used the air force. We crossed the line of control. We overflew Pakistan occupied Kashmir. We crossed the international boundary. We hit inside proper Pakistan. Balakot is in Pakistan, but as you are aware, Balakot is not in Pakistan occupied Kashmir. So that is where we breached their air defence system. We breached their Pakistan air force. We hit and we came back safely. Now that is the strength, military strength of a nation. Mm. Now on ground, people can have their own versions. I will go by what the government and the air force version is, and that is what is final with me. I will not go into the politics or what the politicians are saying. as a soldier i would know if our air force has reached there they have bombarded that place they have achieved their aim now i am not going to quantification because that would get into the sure. polit- political uh, yeah. arena which i want to not what get. did what did your people feel then on the ground you know those who lost uh, their men they they might have lost family uh, in pulwama and and of course you eliminated the terror but uh, terror module as you said within 100 hours but then when balakot happened it must have given this surge of confidence isn't it and i'll give you a small uh, example or uh, anecdote balakot happened pulwama happened in pulwama it ha- happened where we lost 40 crpf uh, brave hearts line of control mm. in kupwara sector is at a mm. different level there are different units the army deployed there when our aircraft crossed the line of control by the way they went into balakot through my area so when they crossed the line of control the boy on the duty there told this company commander he called me up directly and the chirpiness the josh in his voice sir chale gaye yeah. but that is what balakot did to the morale of every indian not only a soldier hmm. i could see that thing on the telephone earphone and the way this young boy young major was trying to tell me ke sir gaye matlab 
he he couldn't even wait to tell his chain I of command i can see uh, general that yeah. in spite of so many operations you're getting emotional yeah. even thinking back on that and because it was important for us to hit back hmm. and i'm very glad that the government decided to hit back and hit back hard hmm. but these are decisions which are taken with a lot of uh, foresight and it takes a lot of planning i mean man to karta hoga that every time there is an incident you hit back immediately but to restrain yourself is also a big task isn't it i mean it's a very considered decision hmm. you have to weigh the pros and cons you have to weigh your own vulnerabilities you have to weigh your strengths you have to see enemy's vulnerability and then you hit you got to cover your deficiencies and vulnerabilities before you hit so that in case there's a counter strike hmm. you don't get hit further badly right so this is a military appreciation and i'm glad it was done to the precision and when we decided to go in nobody knew including pakistan that tonight indian air force will go in and that is the type of secrecy which was maintained talking about secrecy i mean you've done uh, intel uh, like i said earlier that you must be seeing because you're so active on social media that when you see this kind of disinformation deliberate misinformation which goes out man to karta hoga to say that what you're saying is wrong with i have the information but you can't because when you're in the hot seat you cannot you cannot tell them that what you are doing what you're saying is wrong but the real stuff is this and when the light or not a lot of noise is always good for intelligence a fog of war as you were saying fog of war so that your actual intelligence then doesn't get picked up 